Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. First Sunday of Advent. No, it's not. Not yet. Don't rush it. Don't rush Advent. Don't rush it. Don't. Three weeks until Christmas. Don't rush Advent, Tim. That's all I'm asking. The lights aren't up yet. 23 days, but who's counting? And counting. So, uh, for those who might not know, one of uh, our, well, it can be anybody. Recently, a lot of people have been taking, different people have been taking the box. Somebody takes the home of the box, much like the one on the screen. Put something in it, brings it back. I don't know what's in it. I haven't even had a chance to even try to sneak a peek today. And we've got to come up with a story based on whatever's in the box. So I hear it was a team effort. Yeah, for Dakota. Um, and and it, was, it was Dakota who got the box, right? But she's not the one who put anything in. No. That's not helpful to me at all. <laughs> I do try to kind of predict what might be in the box. I'm almost, almost what never right. I have no idea. Well, you can shake it. I can shake it. I love shaking the box. This is like perfect. You can shake it as hard as you want. <laughs> I don't trust anybody here anymore. That's, you know, this has been really tough on my trusting my fellow church family members. It sounds like lights. Lights? Like Christmas lights. Apparently I have Christmas lights on my brain. You always have yeah, Christmas lights. I don't know. Are they all the same? No, they're all different. <laughs> they're definitely not lights. No, they're definitely not. They're bracelets. They are bracelets. In yeah. case you see, there's enough for everybody here, right? Did you bring enough for everybody? I'm just saying. No. Let me see. Let's see what some of them say. So there's always, on these bracelets, there's always a message, right? Yep. This one says strength. Oh, this one says soldier of God. It's in camo. Ooh. This one says Jesus is the center of something particular. The season. Jesus is the center of the season. Very appropriate. Very appropriate for Advent. And then God rocks. God rocks. And I took the one that says courage on it. And you have courage. So all kinds of different messages, and I'm sure you've seen them too with, you know, every, a lot of charitable organizations create their own little uh, wristbands with various inspirational messages. So fired you can take, faith. what's that? Fired up for faith. Fired up for faith. You've got all kinds of good ones here. Next time you, you really should bring more to share with everybody here. Well, this was all we had. <laughs> <laughs> But why do we put these on? Why do we? Why do people wear these? What do you think, guys? Because you can. Because you can. That's how old. <laughs> no. Anybody else? Anybody jump in here? Why do you think you can? What do you think? Jeff, why do you? Why do you think people wear these? that message with you. It's, and it doesn't necessarily have to be the message on this, these bands, but whatever the message is that you're carrying with you. And I think it's important that we carry the message of God with us. These actually remind me a lot of an app on my phone. I have now, I have been, I, I'm very excited about this. I've had it for a few months, but um, I have an app for the Bible. Very simple, right? On my, anybody else have an app for the Bible on their phone? I see a couple of hands. I can carry the message wherever I go. Without having to have the Bible in my hands. Because literally the phone is almost always, I mean, be honest. Your phone is probably almost always either in your pocket or in your hand, right? 
You can carry that message just like you can carry that message on your wrist. You can carry that message in your hands these days. And I think it's, it's a great tool. And wearing these little wristbands, maybe somebody would ask you about that. What is that? What does it say? And you can share that message. Or maybe you have your phone out and you're reading the Bible. And somebody says, hey, what are you looking at? And you can share that message. So I hope you will carry God's message with you at all times. It doesn't have to be literally. It can be up in here. And I hope you share God's message with you at all times, any time you get. Let's, <laughs> let's bow our heads and close our eyes. Dear Lord, we, we thank you that your message, your word, can go with us anytime. Whether it's a simple Bible verse, a message that we wear on our, on our wrist, a Bible that we open, a Bible that's on our phones, a verse we've, that provides inspiration. And help us to share those messages that we carry. In your name we pray. Amen.